Ryan, it's been a few days since the defeat of the weekend, but how has the squad been able to return the focus to, to now turn in into Stockport? Listen, we've obviously gone over the defeat, it wasn't good enough, but um, it's all about the next game, it always has been. That's how I try and see it, and, and that's how the lads see it and the staff, so it's all about putting it right into the next fixture. And Cottrell's been very uh, almost trustworthy of the, the back three that you've got in there. How much has that had a benefit to, to both your game and the, and the players with you? Yeah, of course you can get into a rhythm and, and um, can give you a lift knowing you, you've been given trust, but also at the same time, we're experienced at the back, so we know full well that we need to be, be towing the line and putting in the performances to, to keep the shirt because we've got hungry lads on the bench and lads coming back from injury to really push us and see us over the line and get the results we want. I guess it's also important that the form has also improved since the gaffers come in. How important has that been for the, for the confidence of the team as well? Yeah, of course. Like we went on a spell where that win was elusive and um, obviously the lads can, and myself can lose confidence. The football club can lose confidence, but we picked up some good wins. But they're in the past now. It's all about um, the remaining fixtures and taking one at a time. Obviously, it comes in quick succession this weekend, but it's all about Friday now and, and really uh, putting our best foot forward. As a centre-back as well, how important has that relationship been with Richard Keogh back there, as, as well as Geordie as well? Yeah, Richard's been brilliant. Obviously, Geordie's been bad. Obviously, he had a couple of injuries start of the season, a couple of unfortunate ones. So, like I said, it's getting that rhythm as a free back there, and I think it's really stood us in good stead. But like I said, there's more to come from us. We can contribute with goals, and we're always looking at how we can improve. But more importantly, the not has given us that good platform and base on Friday to go and get the three points. You do mention Friday, an informed Stockport side who are at, towards the top of the table as well. What can you expect from them? Yeah, of course, they're going to be full of energy, full of life. They're chasing promotion, but on the flip side of that, we're chasing to stay up there. We know how big the game is, the magnitude of the game, and, but we also know what we're capable of. We haven't shown that in the last couple of fixtures, so it's, it's about us. We want to focus on us and um, give the fans something to cheer on Friday. And when you are considering at this point in the season, it's kind of who wants it more in these sorts of games. Table sometimes doesn't come into play, does it? Yeah, of course. We want it. We want it bad. We work hard every day, but it's, we have to have to show that on Friday. I think sometimes it can come across as a, a lack of trying when, when you're low on confidence. So we need to work on our confidence as well. But that comes from working hard, putting the tackles in, covering the ground. So that's what we really spoke about going into Friday.